What's up, YouTube? Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. Hope you all having a good day and with your families and whatnot. Just enjoying the day, you know? Uh, <clears throat> so here's the uh, magnets and the coils. I have them coming up into a uh, rectifier. And my connection is here to my meter. So let's go ahead and turn it on, see what I will do. I'll let it speed up. Okay, so uh, a couple things. Uh, <clears throat> it's reading what with the AC. Let me see. <laughs> Okay, about three volts, maybe a little over three volts. So, not that good, not that good, you know. So, I'll put that there and I'll disconnect from there. And let's just flip this over. Oh, wait a minute, is that connected? Yeah. Just flip this over to the side. So, basically, Something just fell, I don't know what it was. But there's my coils. Um, there's a screw in the center with a water bottle cap. And basically my wires are kind of under that cap. And that's not really that good. So I might have to redo this whole coil and desolder all my connections and resolder. Have my wires coming connecting underneath here and then glue them down to the board so they're not touching each other but anyway these are the magnets guys these are really small oops really small uh magnets let me get this stupid thing here painting it you know what i mean trying to do a video Damn, gotta be quick, gotta be quick. So really small magnets, you know. I wanna I plan on getting big magnets and at least a one inch uh round or square magnet and seeing if it does any better, you know. So not that good, it's only <laughs> three volts, that's pretty sad, you know. So it's going to be probably a volt on each uh, phase. And I definitely got to try to pick that up a little bit more. These ends here, I need to shorten a little bit. A little bit, get them closer to the magnet. I'm going to be waiting until I get the new magnets because I don't want to shorten them too far. The new magnets might be a little thicker. So I got to wait. But anyway, I want to show you the uh, generator, and uh, there's power going to each line. I'll just turn this on again. 
So that might be a problem with this rectifier because the ground shouldn't be hot, you know, that shouldn't be a hot. The hot here, let me see, this is the ground, this is the hot, so I shouldn't have hot in the yellow. So I do have hot nails. So maybe there's a problem with the rectifier. And I'll have to get that. Uh, I'll have to figure out something else for the rectifier. Put that up there. I'll mess with that in the future, in the near future. Uh, so that's about it guys. Uh, I wanted to do an update on that And with this little setup here, this was a transformer to a plug To what? I don't know. I took the black cover off it and stuff and Basically, it's just I plug it in here And it's giving me 10 volts all right, YouTube, check this out. Got the plug. Basically, this is putting out DC, and I can run all these bulbs. I don't even have to use the diode, and that's 10 volts, according to the meter, you know, 10 volts. So that's pretty cool. Awesome. Thanks a lot, guys. Have a, a happy Thanksgiving. Have a great Thanksgiving. Enjoy your family, and... What I'm going to go do, I snuck out to do this video. <laughs> That's all right. Probably like this little guy, too. Oh, that was bright. That was bright. And, and keep in mind, guys, these, these uh, phones, they have filters. When something really bright, it, it dulls it, you know, so these, these were pretty bright. It's pretty cool, you know. But anyway, thanks for watching. I gotta get right, I gotta run out here. People calling me. Must be, uh, time, time to eat. <laughs>